What's the deal? Family, look, today we got a special video, man. We doing a Ozzy meat pie mukbang, man. We got the bronzed Ozzy in LA, as you can see the flag back there. Um, I told you guys I was gonna end up doing this, so we here and it's about to happen. All right, man, I ended up ordering seven different pies, all different flavors. Um, they're all gonna be smaller size than the ones I had in the other video, just because it's cheaper. It was a lot of money, man. <laughs> <laughs> so y'all better subscribe y'all better subscribe i spent like at least 50 bucks on this man so y'all better hit that like button subscribe and also let me know like what other stuff you want to see on the channel like different types of foods there's a french paste a french uh restaurant i've been thinking about going to uh a different types of asian like cuisine and foods let me know i'm in la so we got plenty of options man don't be afraid to get in the comments let me know what you want to see i think there's also jubilee which is like a uh I want to say it's like Philippine, like fried chicken or something like that. That's in LA too. Let me know, man. Get at me in the comments, y'all. Get at me in the comments. We ain't lost no gains either. You see that? We ain't lost no gains either. So don't think we playing out here. This is my cheat day, man. I got my meal prep and all that, man. I came from a hard workout this morning, man. So, so we ain't losing no gains. We just getting swole out here. You feel me? We getting swole. Big dog. Big dog. Big dog style, yo. Big dog style. The bag is secured. Let's go. Look at that, bro. Look at that, bro. We ain't playing, bro. We ain't playing, bro. We ain't playing, bro. This is not a drill, bro. Ground beef, impossible. Pepper steak, lamb, Thai chicken curry, chicken bacon mushroom, sausage, and Zach strawberry lemonade. Appreciate y'all. Thank you. Thank you. You feel me? I'm about to mess around and hit a PR in the gym after this. I'm going to gain 36 pounds of muscle. All Aussie muscle. Straight Aussie muscle out here. Let's get it, y'all. All right, man. The food is here. Look, I was going to drive home and eat it like I did last time. But instead, I'm just going to eat it like as fresh as possible, man. So I don't want it to get cold. I don't want it to like like loses its flavors, its juices, you know what I'm saying, Pauls? But I don't want to lose its juices or none of that, so we gonna eat this like as fresh as possible. We about to throw down on this, man. I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna, you know, really make y'all watch me eat too much. I'm just gonna try to munch them down real quick and then uh, give my review of each one, how I feel about it, and I'll give like a, a order, like a, a, a tier list from which one I thought was the best to which one I thought was the worst. Um, and how I feel about the biscuit, because the Anzac biscuit looked messed up last time, bro. Y'all remember the video. Y'all remember the video, man. If you not, go watch my first Aussie mukbang. The Anzac biscuit looked pitiful. So hopefully this time it looks better. And the same thing with the sausage roll was dry. And y'all said, bro, I need to put the tomato sauce, the ketchup on there. So we got, we got, we got all that, bro. We got all that. We ain't playing today. So... We came very much prepared, thanks to you guys. And uh, let's get into this one, man. I think I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go with the ground beef first, man. I gotta go with the ground beef first, just cause that's our base. We gotta have a baseline, right? On the first time I, I ordered them, I got individual sizes, cause I only got a couple of them, and they're like, probably like this much bigger. So these are party sizes. If you look at my hand, it's still a good size though. It's still a good size. So let's get to it. I'm not a professional yet. I don't got like a tray or nothing like everybody else, man. I'm just, we doing this just, we thugging it out, man. We thugging it out. How you put the, how you put the ketchup on here? You put it on the top or do you put it on, on the side? Like, a, you know what I mean? I'm gonna put it on the side. I feel like that's where I'm gonna bite, so. Talk to him. If you're gonna talk to him, talk to him nice, man. Yeah, that's way better with the ketchup. Way better with the ketchup. Yeah, y'all was right. Y'all was right about the ketchup, bro. Way better. Ground beef is finished. Because I've had it before and because I still gotta try the other flavors, I gotta get that one like a seven. That's just gonna be my baseline, seven. Next up, I'm gonna go with the chicken bacon. Chicken bacon mushroom pie, man. Okay, it's a little different. 
So this one got sesame seeds on top of the actual biscuit. That's fire. Looking inside. Y'all wanna check inside? Is that looking good? Y'all let me know, is that looking right? Let me know, man. Ozzy Pie, let's get it. Yo, the mushrooms going crazy. At first it's a little weird, but then when you really taste it, you like, whoa, that's the mushrooms hitting. Oh yeah. Just finished with the chicken bacon mushroom. That one was good. The mushrooms are kicking, right? Only thing is, I couldn't really taste the bacon. I couldn't taste the bacon, man. I could taste the chicken. I could taste the mushrooms. But I was like, where's the, the first bite? I tasted some bacon. But after that, I didn't taste no bacon. So I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry. I got to give the chicken bacon mushroom like a six. I'll give it a 6.5 because the mushrooms are kicking. I'm not going to lie. But it wasn't better than the ground beef one to me, man. Next up, we got the lamb pie. Let's get it. Hey, I like lamb, bro. I be getting these gyros. I think they're called gyros. They, I, they look like gyros, right? It looks like it's spelled gyro. G, G Y R O. But I think it's called pronounced gyro. But I get them at this Mediterranean spot. It's lamb. It's like a lamb plate. Fire, bro. So hopefully this doesn't disappoint me. If y'all like lamb, let me know in the comments, man. I know people either hate it or love it for some reason, but I like it. All right, so here we got the lamb. Basic on the top, it got a little garnish on there. A little slight little garnish, man. How's it looking? Let me know. Let me know, y'all, what's going on? Looking proper or nah? This time we switching up the ketchup routine, bro. I've been doing the ketchup on the sides like this. I'm gonna do, I'm gonna go all on the top this time, man. Y'all let me know which way to do it, I don't know. Lamb pie, let's get it. Smacking, bro. Woo. Oh, they got the green. What's that? I don't even know what's in there. That thing, that thing is smacking, dog. We need to stop playing with them. Oh yeah, this done. This done set the standard. This done set the goddamn precedent. This done set the goddamn precedent, y'all. They got potatoes in here too. They got potatoes in here, bro. They got green. It was like peas, potatoes. Man, I gotta read. I gotta read the description, man. That's my fault. I just be buying the shit. I don't even be reading what's in it. Wow, dog. The lamb pie was just hitting different. That's a nine, bro. Easy. The thing about that one is the potatoes, bro. It had, they got potatoes plus the lamb, so it makes it even more filling. But it also adds more flavor to it. That was, whew, that was my soul, my soul, man. That was it right there. That was it. All right, man. Now we got the impossible vegan pie right here. This one does not open up. All the other ones opened up. This one not really opening up for me. And look, I don't know, the garnish, man. It was no heart and soul into this one, man. I don't even know what that is. Just, just no heart and soul in that one. But we still gonna run it up regardless. How do y'all feel about the vegan pies in Australia? If they even do they even make vegan pies in Australia? And if they do, how do they match up to the regular ones? You know, let me know in the comments. It's gonna be hard to, to follow up that lamb pie, man. I'm sorry. This is gonna be tough. Second bite, second bite, man. I'm gonna give it a chance. I'm gonna give it a chance. Y'all see the face though. I can't hide it. I'm gonna give it another chance. Mm-mm. 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 Nope. Mm-mm. See? This is going back in the bag, bro. I'm cool. Mm -mm. Hell no, that ain't it. 
I ain't even gonna eat that. No cap, that ain't it, bro. That ain't it. That's a that's a one. That's a one. I'm not even a picky eater, bro. I eat a lot of shit. I ain't eating that, bro. It tastes weird, bro. I don't like it. I see why they didn't put no love on the garnishment. That shit ass. They didn't even want you to look inside of it. They didn't even want you to look inside of that one, bro. Nah. Nah. Impossible. Impossible ground. Nah, that ain't it. Sorry. X, bro, that one. We going chicken. We going chicken Thai curry next, man. Hopefully this one saved the day because we going chicken Thai curry next. Bro, I hope after that fucking impossible vegan one, bro, I need something good, man. I need something good. Hopefully this does the job. All right, man. Pie number five. Chicken Thai curry. Let's get it. Mm. Damn. Y'all see that inside? That was good, bro. This tastes like good and healthy. I know it's probably not healthy at all, but like it tastes like it is in a good way though. Classic uh, Thai curry taste to it. Yeah, that's good. That one gets a seven. Just as good as the ground beef, man. It's right there. Different taste, different flavor, but just as good. All right. Last but not least, pepper steak pie, man. Let's check this out. Can y'all see that? Boom. Yeah. Let me know how it's looking, man. Um, I've already had the steak one, so that's why I got the pepper steak. Gotta switch it up. I didn't want to get steak and pepper steak. So, yeah, we have to go with the pepper steak, man. Also, the garnish. You feel me? See, you see the garnish. You know what I'm saying? I'm kind of full, man. I ain't gonna lie. Pepper steak. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Just as good as the regular steak and a little bit better. Bro, I literally just inhaled that. I didn't even give it a chance to live, bro. That's crazy. That was good. That was the second best one. Easily. I get that one at eight. Definitely better than the ground beef. Definitely better than the chicken thigh. And not as good as the lamb, though. All right, man. Now we're on to the sausage roll, man. So last time I had this, it was mad dry, bro. It, it, it was still like okay in taste. Like the sausage tasted okay, but the bread was all crusty. It was just not it, bro. And y'all said, bro, if anything you gonna try with the ketchup, tomato sauce or ketchup, it has to be the sausage roll. Like you cannot eat that without that, bro. So we got that. It's our last ketchup package. This is the sausage roll, man. So you get a good look at that. And that's it right there. You know what I'm saying? So hopefully this time around, it looks a little better presentation-wise, but still a little, I'm skeptical, man. But let's get to it. Mm -mm. This bread be disintegrating, bro. You take one bite, this shit just, just disintegrates, bro. It does taste a lot better with the ketchup. I ain't even gonna cap. It does taste better with the ketchup, man. I don't like how the bread is made around it, but the sausage is still good, man. So I'll still give it a thumbs up. I do know what y'all thinking too. Bro, you've been eating all this shit with no beverage, bro. I got a beverage, bro. I got my bev, bro. Strawberry mint lemonade. Same as last time, bro. I told you guys. It's fire. I didn't want to drink it too fast. I didn't want to fill up. Fire though. Strawberry mint lemonade, bro. All right, we gonna finish this off, man. With dessert. Ain't no say it on here, but we got the Anzac biscuit, man. All right, man. Okay. This is what I'm talking about. Look, this is it right here. Y'all let me know, does that look right? Is that how it's supposed to look? Bro, last time I got it, bro, if you guys don't believe me, go watch my other, my first Australian mukbang. The biscuit was literally falling apart, bro. It, it was like, I don't know if they put too much, like, water or too much milk or too much something. They heated up too long. It was too, it was super moist, bro. It was literally, like, wet and, like, sticky and, like, falling apart, bro. 
But this one is solid. You feel me? I'm holding that thing. Solid, bro. You know, straight line, bro. Solid. No, you know what I mean? Looks way better. The last one, bro, it was all like wet up in here and moist. It was falling apart. It was still good. It was still good. It was just loaded with sugar. That's probably what it was, really. But it was like texture wise, was trash, bro. But this is like an actual biscuit, bro. Like for real, for real. Mm -hmm. Ooh, boy. That's a biscuit, bro. First bite. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Should I say it? I think I should. This thing smacking, bro. God damn. Smack city, bro. This tastes just as good as the first time, except 10 times better texture, bro. Like, I can actually eat it and, like, pause chew on it and stuff like the other one it was just like it was too soggy it's like soggy bread or something you know what i mean it's like it's, yeah, it's too much it's too much big i can actually eat this bro legit it's not super it's crunchy on the outside or crispy and a little bit more softer in the middle but not soggy if this one is a 10 out of 10 the other one was like a five or a six it had the sugar and taste but not the same experience, bro. That's quality right there. That's that, that's that good quality right there, man. All right, y'all, man. That was the Aussie meat pie, or you can just say the Aussie, the Aussie mukbang in general, the Aussie food mukbang in general, man. Thank you guys for joining me on this one. Uh, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe to the channel, man. Let me know more foods you want me to check out in the comments. If you guys got um, other foods from different cultures, different places around the world you want me to try, let me know. Um, that's pretty much it, man. I love y'all. I appreciate y'all. Make sure to go check out my workout videos, too. Uh, I want to provide different fitness type of content, but the workouts are like what's easy for me to do right now. So, but if you guys want to see other stuff, I'll make time to do the other stuff. You guys just got to let me know what you want to see, what you want from me. I'm here to provide whatever it is to help or entertain you guys. So that's pretty much it. Love y'all again. Appreciate y'all again. Real is rare and real always reaches everyone. See y'all next time. Peace.